The next feature that I'd like to show you is the Create a Card feature of giftcards.com. This is one of our most popular features. On giftcards.com, you select Create Your Own Gift Card. You can select from one of the pre-designed cards, which we have about 10,000 designs, probably more, and those are submitted by our users through our PicPaid program, where we actually pay our users for submissions of images. Uh, or you can create your own card. We're going to create our own card. And in this case, let's select two cards. You could either choose a Visa or a MasterCard. In this case, we're going to choose MasterCard. The next step you go to is the ability to customize this card. Now the first step you'd like to do is click on Get Started, and this is for card number one. You can see quantity two. If you needed to purchase over 20, you would go to WRL.com. That's our corporate website, and that's where you purchase uh, larger quantities of gift cards. But in this case, we're going to do two, so we're going to click on Get Started. You see the white blank. Now this is where we're going to add a photo, so I click on Add Photo. Searches the hard drive. Let's open that photo. And you can see the car on the card here. I could move it, grab it, move it, or I can grab the corners and move it, resize it. I could also use these tools if I wanted to as well. Uh, once I think it looks good, I can click on Preview. If it looks good, not, I can go back. And then when I'm done, I click on I'm Done Next Step. Now that first card would be saved. It says Card Completed. Now I'm on card number two. So card number two, I'm going to click on Get Started. And again, a white blank. Add photo. We'll select this photo here. And this is a Ferrari. We'll move it around. And if I wanted to go back to the original position, just click Original. And that looks good. I'm going on to the next step. OK, so I've got two cards created. And now I'm ready to check out. So I'm done. Now in this step is where you're going to add information about the recipient and the fu fund information for each card. So step one was creating the card. Step two is add recipient info and card funds. So the first card we're going to put fifty dollars. And that could go to John, say Doe. And we could type in a personalized message right here. Or we could select from one of the drop-down messages. I'm going to put my own message. This is great. And then I'm going to go to the next card. And you can see right here uh, the information I just added shows up on the card as well. Next card is going to be 50 as well. And I'm going to put Sally. And this could be Doe. And uh, this time I'm going to select one of the uh, pre-designed messages. Say good job. Scroll down a little bit. Looks good. Click on Next Step. So I've got two cards created now. Next Step is going to add the personalized greeting card. We have several types of greeting cards. We have the standard card, uh, carrier, I'm sorry, is free. That's an 8.5 by 11 piece of paper. The standard greeting card, which is a more greeting card quality card, that's $1.50. And the custom greeting card, which is a fully customized greeting card that you get to upload photos to and so on. That's $2.50. So in this case, I'm just going to select, uh, let's select the gift for you standard card. And inside I'm going to say, this is from Jason, which would be me. And the message is, uh, you did very well on the project. Okay, looks good. Now I could apply this to all cards, which would be these two cards. Imagine if during the holiday you have you know, 10 or 15 cards, you may want to just type in the same uh, message for each one. But in this case, we're going to do two different cards. I can click on Preview if I wanted to look at it. I'm going to go to the next card. Um, in this case, I'm going to select a custom greeting card. Now, you could create your own card from scratch. This is the greeting card, where you upload the front of the card, and then the inside, you could put pictures. Or you could select one of our standard ones for the holiday. Um, I'm going to select this Christmas tree one. Again, we're going to add a photo. I'll add this one. You know, and you could add photos of, you know, children, whatever have you. Anything that you want to have inside here to look great. You can make it black and white, go back to original. I'm finished, so I'm going to go to the next step. Type in my message. Thanks for all you do.